First I created the outline of the kitten. Next I used the willow stick to create some of the background, including the basic eye shape. Then the background is blended. Here I'm using my finger. A lot of artists don't like to do this because it gets very dirty and the oils from your fingers can cause issues. Let me know in the comments whether you prefer to use your fingers or whether you prefer not to and use a cloth or something instead. Now the willow stick is used to do some of the darker parts of the kitten. Again, this is then blended. After this, I used a soft charcoal pencil to put in his stripes. These are then lightly blended. Now different tones are added to create more form. I like to work on different areas of the picture to bring it all together in one piece rather than concentrating on one area. More detail is added to his eyes. His bib, although white, is slightly in the shade, so I'm added some soft charcoal to that. Some of the lighter areas of the kitten have been lost to the charcoal, so I'm bringing them back by using a precision eraser. Sometimes it's better to do the eyes upside down so you can concentrate on the shapes rather than the eyes themselves. So I've turned the picture around. I also find it easier to work on one side rather than stretching across the picture. The ears are quite light, so I'm darkening down behind them to bring them out even further and creating more shading to give a more 3D effect. Again, using a soft charcoal pencil to create more stripes on the top of his head. Now doing the same with the other ear and the background. I used the eraser to create the lighter fur in his ears. The kitten has lots of fine fur, so the precision eraser is used to bring that out. I've only used soft charcoal, so it's easy to remove. The lines are wavy, so they're not all going in exactly the same direction and look more natural. Although the fur is lighter, it's not completely white, so I use my finger to gently blend the colour back down slightly. I'm now adding some finer details and strengthening the darker areas with the soft charcoal pencil. Then it's to the final highlights of the whiskers and eyebrows 